Adele is back, the 15-time Grammy winner fresh off of a six-week run of having the country's number one album, debuted her highly anticipated video for her song, Oh My God, a fan favorite, especially of mine, track off of her latest album, 30, this past Wednesday. So the music video is in black and white, and it is directed by Sam Brown, the same director that directed Rolling in the Deep, and it is stunning and amazing. I'm going to break down some of the Easter eggs that people online have found and myself. Now, on a surface level, if you just have never watched or heard any of Adele's songs, you might look at this video and say, this is chaotic. What is going on? I have no idea what message Adele is trying to come across with, but for those who have been following Adele since day one, since 19, she put a lot of references to her other songs in this this video now this video also features a python a horse dancers flipping in the air burning chairs double the adele and so much more now adele spoke with people magazine to explain how this music video got together she said and i quote we filmed this one on the day easy on me dropped which is a good song there were a million things going on all at once but the attention to detail from the crew was borderline hilarious thank you so much for your patience and pulling it all together it was a lot of fun although right at the end a huge python was on set and i skedaddled my behind straight out of there big thank you to harris reed and louis vuitton for creating the most stunning clothes for me to wear during my I'm a hot mess music video. Now Adele spoke about the meaning of Oh My God to a lot of different interviewers when 31st dropped in November. She said, and I quote, Oh My God is about the first time that I basically left my house after my anxiety and stuff like that started to sort of subside. I went out with some girlfriends and my girlfriends were like, you're single, 30 and ready to mingle. And I was like, I ain't ready to mingle all yet. It was just about the prospect of sort of dating and stuff like that in bloody LA, which is not the vibe. Now we all know we spotted Adele out with her new boyfriend or her new partner, sports agent Rich Paul, which is the agent to LeBron James. They have both gone to different basketball games together and fans spotted some lyrics that she sung about rich paul and she said and i quote boy you give good love i won't lie it's what keeps me coming back even though i'm terrified now the whole premise of the music video is set to mimic the garden of eden and a little bit of snow white the video started with an apple on the chair the chair that she sits in in the music video for easy on me and rolling in the deep and allegedly the forbidden fruit, which is the apple, haunts Adele throughout the song as she sang lyrics such as, and I quote, I know that is wrong, but I want to have fun, which is a strong theme comparison to the temptation ran throughout the video. We do see a huge python winding itself around the chair, which symbols, of course, Adam and Eve in the temptation to bite the fruit. Now, one Twitter user broke down the meaning of the chair, the snake, and the apple saying, and I quote, a simple yet magnificent use of biblical illusion. The relationship, which is the chair, is always tempting Adele to go back just like saying tempted Eve in serpent form, but we also know snakes are toxic. So her staying in a relationship will only result in her downfall. Now, throughout the music video, backup dancers were surrounding her, but Adele did not get up to join the party and was instead focused on her inner battle. Now, in another stunning scene, we see Adele singing, I won't leave myself behind while a little boy is playing with apples in the background. Now, a lot of fans are thinking that this is a reference to maintaining a strong relationship with herself and her son, Angelo, who's nine years old, despite her marriage breaking down. There's also another scene where we see two Adele's sitting side by side from each other. A lot of people are saying that in this scene, Adele sees herself as her only competition. Now, towards the end of the music video, she modeled an off-the-shoulder red ball gown dress. Adele begins to proceed to actually bite the apple that's on the chair and she walks off the camera. Now, a lot of Adele fans are saying that this is her darkest music video yet. We all know we've seen Rolling in the Deep and that music video had a lot of religious undertones as well. So people are saying that there are similarities between the two, especially since they have the same director. Now, I've seen this music video at least three times already just to catch everything, but make sure that you guys go check it out. 
It has 21 million views on YouTube right now and is number 11 on trending for music and it dropped on Wednesday so it is still going strong. What did you guys think about the music video? I liked how she has so much symbolism and it feels like each and every one of her videos and Adele has been giving us content like this for years and it just seems like every single time she's elevating herself and she's bringing us along as well and I just I stand I stand Adele what do you think is going to be her next music video that she drops make sure that you guys comment below your thoughts did you like this music video what were you guys hoping or expecting to see did you guys catch any other easter eggs make sure that you guys comment below your thoughts like and subscribe for some more Taylor Talk so that this video can circulate. We are on a road to a thousand subscribers. And as I always say, stay safe. See ya.